Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can install Wine on your Ubuntu operating system and use it to install some exe file on your Ubuntu operating system. So if you don't know, Wine is a tool using which you can install Windows uh, executable file on your Ubuntu operating system. So let's see how we can install it. So for this, you need to go to your favorite browser and search for Wine HQ, which is the official website for Wine, right? So just uh, enter Wine HQ in search and the first link which will appear here will be from winehq.org. So I'm going to click on this link. Here you can uh, read about Wine. We want to download it, so just click on the download link here. And then you can choose the binaries. For Ubuntu, you can select this Ubuntu option. And then you can see the step-by-step -step guide to install uh, the Wine on your Ubuntu operating system. So we're going to just uh, copy these commands and uh, paste it into our uh, Ubuntu operating system. So for this, I need to open the terminal. For opening the terminal, I can just press Control alt t on my keyboard or I can just click on the application section and I can see the terminal option here. Once the terminal is open, I can give this command which I have copied, which is this first command. Let me just make it bigger so you can see all these commands here. So this is the command which I have copied and I have pasted this here okay so now i'm going to press enter and give my ubuntu's password and then this is added now we need to uh, give the next command which is this command which is going to create this directory in uh, your ubuntu operating system let me just paste this command and then press enter then give the next command which is to get this uh, wine hq key let me just copy this and then paste this and then press enter and this is added now once you added the repository depending on uh, the version of ubuntu you have you can copy one of these links so for me i have ubuntu 22.04 so i'm going to copy this uh, line of command if you have newer version it will be listed here so just uh, copy the command for your ubuntu version as i said i have ubuntu 22.04 so i'm going to copy this command and then paste it into my terminal and then press enter so once you have added uh, this command and executed this command you can see uh, this command is executed successfully. So what this has done, this has downloaded the Wine HQ source file. Now in the next uh, uh, step, you need to give this command, which is uh, sudo apt update. So it's going to uh, update all the Ubuntu package indexes. And uh, you can see this is also added now, right? So sudo apt update is finished. And now the last step is to install the wine. So you can choose from these uh, versions. I generally go with the stable branch, which is the first one. You can also um, try development branch or staging branch, but I will choose the stable branch from here. So I'm, I will copy this one and then paste it into my terminal and then press enter and then press Y, enter, which is going to install Wine on my Ubuntu operating system. So let's wait for it to finish. So once Wine is installed, uh, you can uh, try Wine uh, and install any exe file. Let me uh, clear the terminal. And then I will just write this wine command here. And you can see uh, wine is working. 
for uh, using wine you need to give wine and then the program name and then some arguments here right so let's download a windows executable file and then we will try to install that executable file in our ubuntu operating system so let's say i want to uh, download notepad plus plus on my ubuntu operating system as you might know uh, notepad plus plus only comes in the form of windows executable file and uh, we don't have the ubuntu version for it right so i'm going to click on download notepad and then i'm going to click on this uh, installer option here and you can see it downloads the exe file you also know that you can't install .exe file directly on your Linux operating system, right? So for this, you will need Wine. So this uh, Notepad++ .exe file is downloaded. I'm going to go to the location where it's downloaded, which is in my downloads folder. And this is the .exe file which I have downloaded, right? I can right click here and then I can click on open with other applications and then i have this wine windows program loader here so i can click on uh, this option which says wine windows program loader and then click on select which is going to uh, load this exe file using wine on my ubuntu operating system you can see wine mono installer right i can click on install which is going to start downloading this uh, installer, I think. So wait for some time and then you will see this uh, installer for Notepad++ is started, right? So even though it's an exe file, I can install this exe file on my Ubuntu operating system, right? So you can see the installation of uh, Notepad++ is uh, started. I can, I can choose the language, click on OK, and then click on Next, and then click on I agree, and this will be the default location. We will see the location also. Then click on Next, and then click on Next, and then click on Install, and Notepad++ will be installed, right? I can run this Notepad++ by leaving this checkbox as checked, click on Finish, and it's going to launch Notepad++ Hopefully, you can see Notepad++ is started on your Ubuntu operating system using the exe file, right? If I go to the applications and search for Notepad++, I can see this Notepad++ is listed in my applications also. So, I can use it normally as a normal Notepad++ and it works fine. Let me close this go to my applications, search for uh, Notepad++ and I can open this Notepad++ again using my applications and everything is working fine. So this is how you can install Wine and then using Wine install any executable on your Ubuntu operating system. I hope you've enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next video.